we start with one of our charts, we want to see how we can look for trade. First of all, if we refer to our analysis, we have been looking for buy. And when the price, almost as we can see the price tag, the target, because if we refer to our analysis, when the price was here, we mentioned we can look, we should start to manage whatever the trade we have within this move. And we mentioned we're looking for continuation anyway. This is what we get. And right now we want to see what's the next. There is no much changes. The only thing is we get this move and the target, the price almost all, uh, tag the target, what we have been looking for. And in this case, we move to daily chart. We mentioned in our analysis, we're looking at this flat and we want to see the continuation. And right now we want to see whether we can continue or not. The price can continue or not. That's why if we get any trade setup based on one hour chart, this is what we're looking for. And if we refer to forward chart, this is what we get. The only thing is we mentioned we're looking for continuation. The only thing is we need to know about if this one turned to a correction relative to this. That's mean if we get any trade setup, we can look for buying, but we should have the proper management. Anyway, right now, if we want to look for next trade, we need to get the correction based on forward chart. And if we refer to the indicators, we don't have anything to rely on that. That's mean we don't have any information for the price to reverse, okay? Anyway, there is no much changes in if we refer to our analysis in my last video. The only thing is we get this move, Exactly, we get this move. And as we can see the price tag the target, and now we wanna see if there is a continuation. This is the second one we're looking for. By the way, if we put this top in relative to the previous one, if we refer to the indicator space on one hour chart, we have a divergence. That's, that's why from now, whatever the trade we have, at least we need to book some profit because even if we want to look for trade, let this one drop some more. We can look for flat any trade from there we can take the trade it doesn't mean the price cannot continue from here it can but in terms of the trading we want to see how we, we need to get the trade set up because even if you wants to buy from here it's not a really good idea the only thing is we have a divergence how about if i move to 15 minutes you want to see what we have based on 15 minutes we don't have anything to discuss even if the price continue we cannot look for buy the only way is to put our entry above here which is not really good for me, if I want to look for trade, if this one turned to a deeper correction, then any trade from there, I will take the trade, okay? The only things I can highlight here, whatever the trade we have, we should start to manage. And if we want to look for next trade, wait for this one turn to a deeper correction, at least we can look for this one as a flat, all right? Since we have a divergence, we cannot simply buy because of this flag. Again, the price even is continue, we don't have any trades at top. The only thing is, we just manage the trades and we wait for the DP correction. Then if we get the trade from there, we can look for next trade. The reason is I want, I'm highlighting to wait for the correction trade setup in case this one reverse or turn to a deeper move. Because we mentioned based on forward chart, we're looking for continuation, but the only things we need to be really careful if this one turned to flat in relative to this. The reason is if we move to forward chart, sorry, daily chart, in the bigger picture, we mentioned if this is the internal correction and this one is in relative to this, okay? That's why if we want to look for buy, we need to be really careful. Right now, we're looking at this. We want to see the price continue. But the only thing is we need to know about the bigger picture. That's why if we want to look for trade, the best thing is we wait for the better trade setup rather than buying from the flag. The best way really place to look for buy since the price was within this move after we get this down move. Right. Since the price was here, we have been looking for buy. This is the only things we get it. And right now, the only things we do, we tr try to manage the trades we have it. And this one, if turned to a bigger, deeper correction, at least similar to what we have here, then if we get the flat, if we get the trade from there, we can look for buy. In this case, we just follow the chart. If I see any update, I will share. Thanks.